Come on, just go on the thing. do that. Wait a second. Can I do this? If I swap, it does that. Oh, you fool. This is so easy. That was so simple. Okay. <laughs> it's gonna crush him. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I wanted to do. I just couldn't think of the way, but it turns out that just do it when it's right right up there. Okay. Like, are we just waiting for death at this point? Because once again, like, he is just kind of here. You can go all over the place, but I just don't see why I would go anywhere. Let's just wait it out and see what happens. I feel like the force would be enough to make this fall, though. Oh, wait a second. Uh-huh. Yeah, okay. Gotta spell it out. It's gonna change, we'll see what happens. If anything, it should be, at least, I feel like, a fate save. Let's find out! Uh, Alright, yep. Yeah. That's a really radly designed explosion, by the way. Impact crater. Uh-huh. So it's deflecting. It's going to hit Joid or something. <laughs> well, it hit him in the leg. It's not the heart. That's replaceable. Oh, huh. Okay, I think that's Ordroid saying that. And then he just shot him in the end. I mean, that's a pretty darn gosh good- Oh! <laughs> Let's swap it with something. Wait, what? That doesn't make any sense. Alright, uh, sure. Alright, yeah, it's, uh, it's the potato. I- that potato has been in our face for a while now. <laughs> oh, I just got impaled! <laughs> what? Okay, sure. <laughs> this has gotten pale in the bag. Might have lose a function of a few limbs. I guess it's better than death, though. That's true. Oh, jeez. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, what what's gonna happen now? This is just a series of terrible stuff happening. Uh-huh. Dog, time to do something. I'm pressing the ghost trip. Oh, that's a manipulator. What? Huh. Oh, I'm... Oh, as a young child rather than an adult. I get what you're saying there. Uh, well, we can't really, like, unpause the universe, though. Okay. What is it? You're not manipulator. Why are you doing nothing? Yeah, okay, finally. Okay. Uh-huh. Stating- Oh, look at that! Now we got that egg there. We can propel it. Okay. Is it- The game is gonna tell me what to do now? <laughs> this is what- this is this is next level hand holding. 
just telling me outright what to do. As if you're death dependent on it. Yeah, I, I click the button. Whoa! Whoosh! I mean, time here is being extremely ridiculous. Like, I understand why, um, so I think I understand the point is, like, we're kind of banking on this guy's 10 years experience of using ghost powers. But I still think, like, come on, like, you're just telling me what to do. Like, that is just so weird. Uh, yeah, but we'll have time to do something about it. Whatever. Alright, well, uh, I'll do as instruction. <laughs> That's... Snap! Crack! Okay, well, now it's there. People just saw this thing kind of switch around. Don't worry about it. And then, yeah, blue mode. Whoa! He's here! Oh... Is he gonna, like, sacrifice himself? Alright. Whoa! My b yeah, yeah. Here you go! <laughs> yeah, okay. I mean, but, like, you- you- I- you, you could have let me do that- figure out that part on my own. You, you could have given me a chance. I am baffled. I am just completely wobbled by that whole decision. Like, I understand for the sake of maintaining narrative flow, but look at the impact where this is all I can think of at the moment. Like, it's just absolutely wild. Is he still gonna blame himself when absolute nonsense of paranormal nature clearly happened? I had a space debris in my leg. I got now superpowers, but I won't know until I die. Oh, maybe that's why he's, he's feeling fine. It's because his leg is getting healed constantly. Well. <laughs> so there's a guy half crushed to death in front of you. Don't. Look around the corner of the object. <laughs> it's not gonna be pretty. So yeah, so maintaining most of the timeline. I don't know why I'm so concerned about this, but play anything with time travel involved and I get weirdly concerned about this all the time. That's cute, though. That's a cute moment. Ugh, ugh, that pain. That, that, the animation there is really good. <laughs> How? Oh no, there's been people crushed like that. Maybe he just got his legs. Wink and nod. There's a fly around here. I don't like it. I don't know. Like this, Yomiel doesn't have a history of kind of marinating in his own saucepan. It's a cat. That tail is so weird. It's like a fox tail. Kind of limp. Huh. Did it just die from the shock? The cat's fallen a shock? Fallen a, like, coma? Lose consciousness? Like, I have to believe any being with a brain has the ability to just fall unconscious. Like, it's not something I ever thought about. Hmm. Well, confirmed. Why were you in the bag? 
Because you were Yomiel's pet. He just, he was a support animal that he was carrying around with him. I can believe that. He had a matching scarf. Oh, uh, man. Well, the cat wasn't a mastermind, but certainly was around. Wow, that is a neat rendition. Okay, so hanging around humans may understand, like, may understand why it's aware of human things. Huh. That's such a cat-like thing to do, though, to get involved in looking for affection at the absolute worst possible time. Okay, and yeah, also he's used to using the cat as a sort of, like, backup vehicle. Kinda ties in pretty well. And yeah, confirm. Lynn shot the cat. So what's up with the Ray then? Like that's the question. Yep. Oh no, 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 yeah, it lights up like perfectly. didn't notice that he got shot.
Yeah, right within reach. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're like trying to remember things that you had no way of remembering. So you were like focusing on the wrong things. Something we just kind of t took for granted turns out is like actually super special. Whoops! Maybe that has to do with the cat's nine lives things. Ah oh, man, this is just all so sad. How can you be surprised by that answer? Oh my gosh, Jowd's paying even less attention than I am. Yeah, honestly, like, you're just gonna be reliving an entirely new, different ten years. Yeah, that is... complicated. Like, you're gonna live two sets of ten years. Like, what are the implications of that? the dog if they're already owning a cat because like, I mean this I feel like the implication is that you might just end up at the same place if everything else ends up going relatively same-ish which I guess is not guaranteed though yeah no yeah because now Alma won't get shot so Lynn's probably not gonna live with them ah eh, well we'll uh, we'll see the universe will see they the characters will see Oh man, what a Nendo. Uh, a lot of video is me silently reading text, but like, there's just nothing I can add, right? It's a well-told story, like me just interjecting and saying nonsense, just... 
wouldn't have contributed a whole much. Can't interrupt the clock. That's ridiculous. <laughs> Sorry about the sniffles. Uh, I do have a bit of the allergies going on. It's a bad timing. Yeah, what's up with you, Ray? Like, what the heck? <laughs> Alright, what's the story here? I'm glad that I, I had almost forgotten. Like, with the way everything was going and the momentum it was setting, I legit had forgotten, and I might have realized, like, later. Alright, another version. This is a long thing, I might have to split this into a few, uh, few episodes. Uh-huh. Yeah, remember that? Remember when we were justified in ending a person's life? Somewhat arbitrarily? <laughs> I don't know. Sorry for the sniffles again. The story of a little creature. So this is like the prime reality. Wow, before the game happens, basically. Just kill these two for essentially no reasons other than expediency. And even then, that costs you two bullets for basically no reasons. Sissel was around. Was that enough? Well, Yomiel Ratter? Yeah, I guess that was close enough. Ridiculous. That is just like some ridiculous circumstances. Follow the events up to here. Okay. Alternate reality missile. So, missile played the whole game before us? What? That is nuts. Just an older, wiser missile. Wow, old dog missile. Wait, he aged in ghost form? Sure, whatever. Maybe that's. Remember, here's how he perceives himself. So he does perceive himself as old. That is wild. He waited so that now the big difference is... Jeez. So you did something like at the last minute here. That is crazy. Well, you learn how to manipulate objects.
Wow, you got like the worst case scenario. That's kind of wild. Oh, huh. I, another thing I was kind of super taken for granted. So in the first loop, the cat got killed in the first loop too? Nothing suspicious here. Oh. Huh. That's ah, a cat, I get that. <laughs> Spook the man. Huh. Crazy. That's a smart puppy. So the time limit was fake? <laughs> yeah! Oh, that's- I knew it! I knew that was- that was a fib. Uh, the way the manipulator could just do things all day, every day, and all that. Like, it's not the lie I expected for the reason- well, that was the reason I thought. I did say that I thought was there to just kind of put a fire under Cecil's feet. Validated. <laughs> That's true. Again, he had 10 dog ears to think of this. To think of what to say, how to phrase it, how to present this information, and he nailed it. Man, loyal to a fault. It was a weird little pause there when I had to load the new music. Wow! Man, like, how do you- what do you say to that? That vlog animation! <laughs> we see it a lot. I don't know what I'm gonna do about this editing-wise. By the way. Hey! Happy birthday, but for real this time! Not with a crime. Yeah, look at that. Cupid ain't turn around. Pfwee! <laughs> it still burns away. Yeah! And there's not a gun in the picture frame. <laughs> <laughs> what? Ah, oh, that's cute. 
So she's still in front of the family. Yeah, that whole thing still happened. Nepotism, just giving away badges. Tragic though about like all the lost experiences, but I mean this is clearly a better life for everyone involved A ten-year-old cat. Oh, what? That's He got he got he got he got a meteorite in him. He's getting rewinded. That's why it was limped. This is real silly, but okay. Man, imagine being stuck in a body of like the equivalent of a child though. Ugh. Hey, it's Alma. Not chickens. You need like one per person. I've seen these people eat. That's pretty big for a kitten though. Like that does seem like the size of a full-size cat. Look how she's holding him against her torso. His tail is weird. It's like it's like it, get, it gets floofier then stops. And I heard something. Uh -huh. Um, what does this mean? So I figured out he had that thing. Yeah, I figured out before it happened, uh, before it got showed. An immortal cat, may I add? Uh, oh, that's going on at the, the speed it wants. I'm not controlling this. We're just very close to speed. I cycle through tech. What a cool game! What a super... The, the game is a story, and what a cool story. Like, it lived and died, no puns intended. Uh, whoa! Missile can dance? What's that rumble? Oh, jeez. Okay. Right, he's a family friend too. But oh yeah, like, uh, I forgot what I was saying, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, the game lived and died by the story, but it just so happened that, boy howdy, did it, live, it lived up to its potential, so don't worry there. Oh, that's spaghetti, that's a giant play. Everyone's just eating like monsters here. What is your weekly dietary budget? Look at that. Ah, oh, so good. Hey, Rao Cow! The LP for this game clearly went well. Does that mean you're gonna be playing more VNs in the future? I, uh, uh, no. Like, I realize that this is the exception. And, like, there was some friction. It took a little bit for me and the game to sync up. And I don't think we ever did sync up. I think it's just the game is that good uh, that... I was able to kind of like force through the unsync and this is clearly the work of an exception. This is an exceptionally well written, well made game. So I don't know man, I don't trust another game in the same genre to be able to do the same. That's my take. <laughs> they let you take another job here though? Like, that's the weird part. Oh, memory. 
you're kind of fun, but you're a you're a cliff note in this game, sadly. Yeah, no, but yeah, yeah, this this was real good. Be happy I play this. You know, we got like all these post alternate reality happening. So I guess the blue people just never really got involved because there's no kismet going on. This guy likes to improvise songs, but really all he does is naming things around him. Oh my gosh, it's chicken! Lazy Susan! A term that people don't use anymore. Because it's called Lazy Susan. <laughs> it's, hey, it's that guy! He still exists. Oh yeah, so his life didn't get messed up, the rocker's life didn't get mixed up. Just everyone overall is just having a much better time. So, is it worth the sacrifice of losing what you once knew? Uh, I think that's a hard question to answer, honestly. See, now they're just regular criminals instead of super criminals. Uh, they just, just half certainly have TNT sticks everywhere. Managed to wedge some in there. I don't know how they managed to do that. Like, there's some sticking out of the door. What's well, like the border? <laughs> just, just a thousand. Well, they're dead. They are literally dead. You don't get to keep the money just because you're surrounded with it. Like, that is not how it works. I don't think you also should take a safe that large and put it on the top floor. Please keep it on the ground floor, or even maybe the basement. Just, you know, just in case something happens, like an earthquake or like a fire. Hey, these kids. Well, that kid, singular, and these adults. They behave like kids, so my mind just kind of went there on its own. Yes, I do! Uh, she just has a thing for accountant types. Yeah, a little bit of someone for everyone. Her hair looks better when it when it blooms, though. Nah, but no, this was an excellent video game. And it was really good. I understand why it was so recommended by so many people for so long. Yeah, that's right. It's Grape Town now. I'm a robot! Whoop! There goes my head. Imagine that they put this gag before the reveal. I probably would have think it's a zombie or like a ghost, a solid ghost. I would have said something dumb like that. It's just a robot. A very regular machine man, machine man made. Oh, pigeons love it! <laughs> love peace and pigeons. That's the power of rock and roll right there. The meteorite is still there. That is accurate. Lovey Dove, not part of the plot. That's my big minor disappointment, but I mean, it's fine. You know, all the other pigeons are huge, too. Animals here are so fat. They are eating quite well. Hey! Oh, I can stand with that, though. Parks should not charge admission. What? What the hell? Are there private parks? I guess that must exist. I just never really thought about it. Oh, he's panicking! He's panicking! He's finally getting out. We don't know who. Hmm. Oh, it's a new dance, but it's been passed on. I mean, you can have you can have a stomachache that is caused by panic or just like stress in general. So now he just does it in fast forward, so he can go through it. That makes sense. Don't worry about it. 
I mean, I don't know how many more times I can say this was good. I had mostly a good time. I feel like I need to append that most. There were rough spots. There was definitely rough spots. Cannot deny that. But, uh... A good time was had. At least eventually. Man, these are some long credits. Yeah, again, I don't... I might have to split this in, like, three parts. <laughs> or something. I'll follow it. It's a myth. It's this is the puzzle for me to sort a little bit later today. Look at all these names. And they get to appear twice because of the way I got the screen set up. It's like double credits. Most people in a game credit don't get that. Melody and Pfeiffer. I always just pluck up one name in particular. So, I was wrong for a lot of a lot of my suppositions, but it's interesting the small amount of places where I was right. Hey Cecil, you're not paralyzed from being impaled in the back and then being immediately crushed by a giant stone statue. Impressive. Uh, did he paint his cat? Probably painted his cat. No, he wouldn't have remembered. Would he have remembered? Ah, he would. He said he would. He and cat remember. Maybe missile. I don't know. I feel like I've already for Keiji and Afune. Huh. You've never seen that scene. <laughs> but it's fine. Ah, oh, that's real nice, though. What? It's moving! Oh my gosh! It's haunted! What? <laughs> okay. Yeah, act all innocent after defying the laws of space time. So they put, like, that's a weird photo when you think about it. Like, the far wall that they don't interact with is, like, apparently pretty far away. To have the camera at that distance, don't- I, I'm overthinking it. Returning the title. No ways around it. I said what I had to say, man. This was good. This was good. I'm very happy I played this 11-year-old game. Um, yeah. Coming up next, something I'm way past due.